What awaits us from the contents of this moon block? Well, find out in the next part. So I hope you enjoyed, and I will see... No, I'm just kidding. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. So, actually, I should probably check my map here. Eh, free running, I suppose. Wouldn't hurt. Flop on over here, and run like the wind. And remember all those shortcuts that I showed you how to get around this place before? You better utilize them. <laughs> <laughs> I am most certainly in. Let's -a go! And we gotta go pretty high up. Like, uh, I mean, all the way up to the top. Yeah! So, when I said utilize all the shortcuts, I meant it. <laughs> I think I'll just do. Uh -uh couple rolls to get ahead and you know smack my face against the wall that that's always good for your time trials let's go ahead and oh well, yeah I guess you can do that trick too you can do little ground pound wall kick and flip around yeah I forgot that you could do that and I just remembered that when I seen blue Koopa do that so okay oh no oh no you don't Nope, we aren't doing that today. We aren't doing this today either. <laughs> and I just gotta go up, make sure you hit this, otherwise you won't be able to wall kick. At least I don't think you can. I mean, maybe you can with some fancy fancy jumps, but it won't be as quick. Like if you do a hat wall kick, hat wall kick, etc, etc on the way up. I think that would take way too long. And that was pretty smooth, besides smacking my face in the wall, but in the details. Blazing fast for always a prize of Moon Bar Moon. There we go. Lost Kingdom Regular Cup. And we go. Part 2 The Master Cup versus Gold Koopa. You know the deal. We've done like 40 of these already. <laughs> So again, I'm going to try and be super efficient, not smacking my face into things, but no promises. <laughs> Alright, we're going to go, oh man, that was the most difficult obstacle of this entire run, I swear. Alright, so I guess I can try, oh, I didn't grab the edge, oh man, I mean, I guess that's okay, but that's still not mega efficient. <laughs> No, that was... I didn't turn around completely all the way, but... Wait, how did you do that? <laughs> what did you do there to get across? I totally missed that. Hmm. It must be a... Oh, yeah. I did it so smoothly the first time. <laughs> and if you smack your face on the wall, there's no way to recover from that, because you're kind of... kind of dazed. Alright, let's try it again. <laughs> Maybe I should pay more attention to where the gold Koopa went through there. Or maybe I should try it myself, because it did something. Anyway. Ooh, ee, oh, well, actually, hold on a sec. It didn't bounce up, like, over there. It bounced up somewhere like here. Like, did it go around? Ah, I see! There's <laughs> just enough height to be able to flip yourself around. Alright. Why am I not doing half jumps there? See, there's a hat jump. Didn't know why I didn't do it the other times, but anyway! I think I got this one in the bag this time. Just tapping that jump button in rhythm and winning! Maybe I should have did a little dive at the end there for maximum speed, I don't know. <laughs> New record, but not the world record! Woo! <laughs> Lost Kingdom Master Cup. And we're done here. And I think the other one that this X is pointing to, because, you know, that's not technically what it is. It's a, uh, something. There it is. There it is. Uh huh. Ah, beautiful. Grab that bad boy. Once it reaches land. You can do it, you can fly! Yes! 
And it's on top of the tree. Can I get up there in one fell swoop? Oh, that, that was the wrong tree! I cannot get up there in one fell swoop then! <laughs> Why did I go for that one when it wasn't even the right color? Taxi flying through Forgotten Isle. And there's a pipe. Probably, I think, because there's a two. There's a two. There's butterflies. No, there's actually typically two moons. Oh, oh! This is one of those ones you gotta be a lot quicker than it looks. So you got these things here. And go. Go, 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 go. It's coming back up. Coming back up. <laughs> Get the idea? Yeah. I don't think I need to get another wiggler for this, I'll just kind of loop around, well actually, mm. uh, go, 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 <laughs> I think there's a power moon in here, okay, no, there wasn't, <laughs> actually, wait, what do I do, actually, no, that's actually just the way forward, yeah, there was something, actually, that I need to break through, though, I think, to get a moon, power moon, though, so I'm just gonna kind of, you know what, I'm gonna, you <gasps> You killed my buddy! Well, he, he was, he was kind of not the, the buddy that he wanted to be because he didn't want to do that, but details, you still killed him! <laughs> yeah, I thought there was something hidden under some block, or maybe I'm just supposed to reach those... <gasps> oh, wait a second! I ruined it. I was supposed to light those with the piranha plants. <laughs> That, ah, oh, I now remember why I was thinking I needed to break something. Because I needed to break the blocks out of the way for the sake of the piranha plant to do its thing. Uh, anyway, hit that, hit that, and we go again. <laughs> nice and quick, please. Oh, by the way, did I get, did I check what was in here? I don't think I did. But yeah, I'm hitting the one on the, like the the further, well, the, like the one that activates the further poison geyser first, because it's kind of the more out of the way one, and you're st you can still get there quick enough otherwise, so it's not that big of a deal should you uh, hit them out of the intended order, I guess you could say, especially if you're going to be uh, with efficiency there. Alright, you can like those for me, please. I, I well... <laughs> Over here, please. Okay, light that one. And light this one here. Oh, no, no, no. One more. One more here. I don't have a rock to put in your mouth here this time, so I can't exactly do that the, the simpler way of just taking over your body. A glow in the jungle. And we're free. We're free. Be quick. Be quick. Be very quick. And I mean very quick, because we got more. Oh shoot, that might not be good. Uh, might not go. Okay, that was not good at all. <laughs> Maybe it's not as tight as I thought it was. Okay, maybe it's pretty tight, but still. We got both moons relatively smoothly, other than me forgetting about the prana plant thing. But let's forget about that, because completion of this place is right around the corner. Or right underneath a palm tree. Mmm, delicious moon fruits. Very crunchy texture. <clears throat> uh, let's see here. I just wanted to dive forward, but anyway. <laughs> just kind of dividing and conquering here, because yeah, I thought there was something... Oh, no, it's actually up. Well, we might as well do the Koopa trick. Oh, wait. <laughs> I just happened to do it perfectly just that one time. Uh, okay, so there's something about this. That. Oh, then that means I've got to do it with the explodable friend there. Oh, and there's also a rabbit to catch. I'll get you in a second here. Alright, so you. I'd like to aim you somewhere that oh, Somewhere that way. <laughs> Let's try that again. Prepare... Yeah. Was that right? Was that gonna work? Yeah, that's right. And... Sure, you don't come to me, I have to come to you. Gonna be that way. Don't mind me, little rabbit there. I'm just gonna go get this moon before I smack you around a little bit. Line it up, blow it up. 
I know it may sound bad for me to smack you around a bit, but I, I assure you, I just- Oh, what do I do? Oh, shoot! Oh, shoot! But I assure you, it won't hurt as much as falling in the poison. That, that is for certain. But I was gonna say, it won't hurt as much as getting smacked around by an enemy or me outright killing you. I just want to stun you so I can touch you and then get your moon. Actually, that might be, uh... Maybe that is actually worse after all. I don't know! I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so you gotta do some fancy schmancy hat movements here. Oh, I slowed him a little bit. Oh, no, no, no. oh well, that'll do. <laughs> Maybe I didn't slow it, but oh, come on. Oh, come on. But I was able to head it off at the pass anyway and caught it hopping in the jungle. So another pipe down in that direction? No, it's gotta be up along the path then. Because that's like, you know, I'm shortcutting this. You can't tell me not to. <laughs> oh yeah, timer challenge now. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! 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 shoot, shoot. Go! Oh shoot! Shoot! Oh no! 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 Mm, I want the wrong tree again. Ah! <laughs> oh, I might as well start up here then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, that, that first move was so smooth, because I went right to the edge of the platform, and then... Hold on, Peach. I, I started something else. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, there's that, too. Yeah, that was the thing that I figured was along the path. Alright, so wait, where was the... Timer chip? Oh, yeah, I was on the first pooper. <laughs> oh, my face! <laughs> Just jumped off the other corner. I just, I, like, I jumped off the completely opposite section that I should have. Anyway, maybe I'll try it like this. Oh, that's right, I don't have my hat to... Yeah, that's why I did the other move before. <laughs> I am an imbecile sometimes, in case you didn't notice. I know, Peach, I know. Hey, hey. Hey, listen, and all that jazz. Okay, so which side do I want to jump down off of? Is it the Peach side? Uh, no, it's, it's the Glide-On side, there we go, alright, try it again. Don't worry, Peach, I'm coming for ya. You can give me your moon soon enough. And triple jump, and yes, I accidentally hit the hat button instinctively, but okay. Doesn't matter, I got that timer challenge complete, and the clock, that was, uh, that was actually pretty... Pretty wide margin that I had there on it because I did it so smoothly. All right. Not now. I found the pipe. <laughs> Actually, where was the pipe? Where was the pipe? No, wait, that was the triangle. So the pipe has got to be down here, the side. There she is. Just ignoring Peach. <laughs> <laughs> There's two moons here. That's why I'm ignoring. I'm, I'm here for the big bonies. <laughs> anyway, it's a thing of you got these sorts of platforms. Feel the rumble. Feel the rumble. Yeah, it's not really anything special there. But you want to go to those sorts of things just to make sure that you're getting everything. <laughs> oh no! Not again! We lost Cappy once again. Man! Man! So now we gotta chase it down. Until it lands onto some sort of uh, teeter-totter type platform. Because, you know, we can't do anything about it otherwise. We just gotta kinda chase it around until it... Well, maybe I should get that bounty. <laughs> but yeah, until it gives up that hat due to some smacking around here. Please just go on the lower area, please. I wouldn't mind if you went... Oh man. Well, as long as I know that you're going to that one, I can set that up ahead of time. Aha. Aha. But yeah, I'll, I'll explore the rest of this poop when I am able to get the scoop of my hat back. Oh man, you're going back over there. See, the idea is to set up the platforms so that it goes on the lower of the two platforms, and that's the only one that it goes to, if I recall correctly. So, yeah, it's just like a little demonstration thing of when you chase it over there. So, if you wanted to speedrun this, you could actually set these platforms up ahead of time, I think, and 
go ahead and go to the corner, it'll fly over there, and yada yada yada. You, you get that you get the idea. How's it going? Stupid bird. Anyway, I'm fine. No problem. Let's go already. Yay! Yeah, you know we can get the main moon. Oh, but there's a secret moon. Chasing a Calepto. Get out of here. I think it's actually oops. I think it's actually like up there. Maybe, uh, well, there's probably a way to get up there at least. I know at the very least, you know, I can take care, I mean, take control of these bad boys. Oh, wait, maybe it was behind the pillar. Behind the pillar? Yeah, it was behind the pillar. Extremely hot bath is completed. Uh, don't fall off the edge, by the way. And I should probably look around here just for the sake of looking around at things because there might be another vibrating thing here. Wait, wait, hold on a sec. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say, I did not have enough height on that jump, and... Ooh, me! Vibrating? Another heart, okay. <laughs> so that's nothing really... It's nothing really super special. I guess you can get coins, too, obviously, but... Eh, how about over here? What's in these bad boys? Another heart! Man, there's a lot of hearts here. Unnecessarily. <laughs> I think that's... Relatively well cleaned out there, I think. Yes, yes. Um, next is Nist. Oh, the note, that's right. You gotta throw your hat at things again here. Alright, you gotta go. Ooh! Well, that's not exactly. Maybe I should be doing like this, actually. Oh, that might be a problem. Oh! Uh, I'm dumb. I was supposed to use the wiggler. <laughs> You know, a tropical wiggler right nearby. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, and there's another moon. That's, uh... Wait, actually, that's... That's not a... Post-game moon, is it? No, yeah, it's gotta be. I was gonna say, I mean, a moon block moon, excuse me. Anyway. Over here. Grab you. Not be dumb. And start this cycle again. There we go. Touch and go. Actually, I'm gonna go to this one right away. And oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Shoot! Oh! Too close for comfort. <laughs> we got it though. I'll take you now. Stretch and shrink. Bingo. And not catching you again. I'm gonna go straight to that moon on the corner of the world above the poison. Well, maybe it's not the corner of the world, but it's pretty close. This is actually ooh, pretty easy one to get. Let's just go from there down to there and jump down to the top of a tree. But I think you know what's coming here. There's two more moons. And I'm kind of at a loss as to where they were. So I'm buying hints. <laughs> Probably against popular demand, but... Well... Well, let's just get this kingdom 100%ed. <laughs> Alright, Toad. Well, hint Toad. I'm ready to spend 100 coins. I get a ton of coins in this coin... Uh, tons of coins in this game anyway, so... Yeah, there we go. These are only just giving me the general idea of where they are anyway, so... Eh. Alright, no more hints, of course. Because there's only two, as you've seen on the list left, so... Here we go. The grand finale of the beautiful Lost Kingdom. It's kind of sad, actually. Oh, it was directly behind me. Oh, so sad. Oh, wait. Oh, there is... Oh yeah! You want me to get a wiggler up here, don't you? If I recall correctly. Came to silence see the strange creature made of differently colored round sections. I'd love a close look at one. Of course! How could I have forgotten about you? <laughs> uh, I think I actually want... I was gonna say, I think I actually want to leave this like this. Probably? Because I think the wiggler can stretch far enough across there. I think... I hope... Yeah. Ooh. That's a problem. <laughs> uh, or am I just not close enough to the edge? Oh, it's too high. 
then how did I get a pooper over there? Hold on a sec. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna flip this around here. Maybe it has to do with this being some other way and maybe me having to go from this edge to that. No, that would be about the right height though. Uh, how about I go I think if I- see the thing about it is I think if I leave a wiggler here and switch this around and just kill it. Oh, it didn't! I thought it would kill it. Maybe that's what I thought the first time too. <laughs> <laughs> ah, so it's built like a chain. That's what lets us stretch. It sounds a bit like an accordion. I understand. The mystery is solved. Thanks to you. <laughs> Self-aware of the sound effects and everything. I met a tropical wiggler. And thank you again for advancing science in this way. You are welcome. Last one. I'm going to go to the summit. Because it seems like the quickest way to drop down to places, obviously. Oh yeah. All this time I've been ignoring Peach and she's actually the last one, that's right. <laughs> so I actually only forgot one. Well, technically two, because I <laughs> forgot about Peach. <laughs> the plant life here is so different from anything I've seen before. What a trip we've been on! I've seen so many wondrous creatures! I picked up a moon power moon as a souvenir for you. Bingo! Peach in the Lost Kingdom. So I wasted 50 coins. <laughs> As you know, I'd like to visit the big city again. Maybe get a taste of hustle and bustle. Sweet. Sweet. And also, um, i seen before, this is kind of funny, I've seen someone manage to actually reach that island without glide on using a really, really fancy long jump. It's like a long jump that's angled to the side, because apparently that gets you, like, extra distance that a regular long jump, like, directly at it won't. No, I don't think I did it right! But yeah, I've seen a video of someone doing that, but I thought that that was just, like, an interesting fun fact, that someone was able to actually manage to utilize the physics... Oh, wait, wait, I think I remember the person... The, that did it, I think did it like a a rolling hat jump with a long jump or something like that. Because you can throw your hat like this and hold it in place and then do a jump off of it by doing uh, like a jump and roll dealio. So you go like, oh no no! Well that was absolutely a fail, but well I'm not exactly sure how I was done offhand, but I just know that jump is possible to do without glide on, which is an interesting little fun fact that I thought I would share with you. <laughs> uh, I'll, maybe I'll try that a little bit later on, but... Since I'm not positive how to do it, and I don't want to burn 800 coins, maybe what I should do is end off the part here. So I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I go over to the Metro Kingdom then, I suppose. Woo!